How you doing? This is Reagan Lipinski with Marine Sonic Technology, and today we are going to be setting up a pressing or a strain relief to go onto the boat from the cable. Um, this is how you're going to raise and lower the towfish without damaging the cable. And so we're going to start off with the wet end of the cable. This is the cable uh, connection that attaches to the towfish. So we're going to throw that in, and this is the pressic that actually attaches to the towfish and the strain relief. We're going to create one of these strain reliefs to attach to the vessel so again we can lower and raise the towfish without any damage. So we're going to go about a foot or two above that lower strain relief. We're going to get our new strain relief. It should come in your kit. It will be rolled up and probably tied with the rubber band and look something like this in your kit. So you can get it, take off the rubber band, straddle it out, you'll see there will be a loop and two pieces of uh, plastic that are wrapping around that. You need those out. So we're going to start again about a foot or two above the lower strain relief and we're going to straddle the cable with the pressic. So it's going to be um, the loop portion will be facing the boat or the dry end of the cable and we're going to braid this cable the strap around this cable and we're going to start off with the right hand side and we're going to loop it underneath we'll take the left hand side and loop it underneath overlapping the right now we're back to the right side which was the left and we will wrap that over the top then left so basically, it is right, left, right, left, all the way down the cable. So again, we're going to go right underneath, left underneath, right over top, left over top, and continue this all the way down until you come to the end. It is a pretty simple and easy braid and you're going to have these two loops or these two holes in the end. You're going to loop those together, one over top. You're going to take a small zip tie or any size zip tie. You're going to place it through and zip it closed. If you don't want that little end on there, we can clip that off. And then we have our pressic. So we can see that there, and you can braid this a, a little bit tight and just kind of maneuver it around and so it's on there. And we will see that this portion will attach to the boat. And as we pull on it, it won't allow the cable to go through, but it won't strip the cable, right? Now, if we need the cable to go down or we're lowering the towfish, you're going to, again, this side will be attached to the boat, but you'll grab the cable right at the top of the pressing and you will push down it will allow the cable to come up. If you need the, to drop the towfish, you'll grab it from the bottom and you'll pull up. It will allow the cable to move. As soon as you release it and you apply tension, it will hold on. We can make it all nice and pretty and it will hold the cable. Again, to raise the towfish, this will be attached to the boat. You'll grab from the top and you'll push down. It will slide the cable. To lower the towfish, again, while it's under tension, you'll grab it from the bottom, and you can either let the weight of the towfish go out, or you can assist it by pulling the cable out. When you are done, <laughs> the tension will hold it closed. It works just like a Chinese finger cuff. It is called a pressic, and you can make these yourself, or you can get them from Marine Sonic, and you should have two or three that come in your kit when you buy the system. Thank you very much. Again, this is Reagan Lipinski with Marine Sonic Technology.